Why did you call me? I called you because I wanted you to get Jasper down from the neighbor's tree. Up there, he's right there. Okay. I'm sorry, but I can't get Jasper down from the tree. <sighs> Too high up. Call dad, maybe he can get Jasper down from the tree. Okay. <laughs> Dad. What is it? Can you get Jasper down from the tree? Okay. Okay, this tree is too tall. I'm gonna go get one of the firemen to help us, okay? Okay. Yeah. Alright, I'll be right back. Alright. Can you please look? Oh, wait, never mind. We sold it. Alright, listen. I went and I told one of the firemen to come here and help us get the cat down. So he said he'll be here in a couple of minutes. Okay. okay. All right, hold on. Are you doing him here to help get the cat down from the tree? Yeah. Okay, but keep in mind, this is not the 1950s, okay? We don't do this anymore. Okay. okay. Doing you a favor. What's the... Do we have to pay you money? No. Ooh, that's nice. Show me where the cat is. All right, up there in my neighbor's tree. Why are you on my property? Yeah, well, we're on your property because my daughter's cat is stuck up here on your tree. Oh, yes. Uh, I see he's scared. Yeah, he is. And with your attitude, you make him even more scared. We're just going to get the cat and we're going to get off your property, all right? You brought a fireman? Okay, listen here, Mr. Fireman. I gotta go inside. I have some beef stew on the stove. I wouldn't want to set a fire on there, you know, have you come back again. All right, so I appreciate you helping my daughter. Thank you. Here's your cat, little girl. Thank you, Mr. Fireman. Oh, I guess we missed you. Yay! Now can you get off my property? Okay, ma'am. Come on, let's go. Thank you. 